Hi and welcome back to another playthrough of Fast and Light. Uh, I'm making this one because apparently my last, what is it, the Stealth Cruiser. Right, last time I made this the video didn't encode properly or sank and it's all blurry so I decided I'll make another one. And let's see. Uh, in case you didn't see that one, the stealth cruiser starts with cloaking rather than shields. So you have to try and buy some shields quite quick. And what else do you start with? You start with the most basic beam weapon, the most basic laser weapon, long range scanners, which tell you information about adjacent beacons, titanium system casing. 15% chance that the system won't be damaged when it gets hit, but it'll still hit the hole. And yeah, start with level 2 sensors. I still haven't managed any of these achievements. Destroy a ship at full health, and avoid 9 points of damage during a single cloak, and get to sector 8 without jumping to a beacon with an environmental danger. I'm sure I've done that, but it just didn't give me it. Oh uh, well. Now, name the ship. Let's call it, not the Nessio. The Creed. And... Your name won't be Thomas, it'll be Connor. Your name won't be Stephen. It will be... Ezio can probably GM for no. This will be Altair. Yeah, yeah. Stealth ship. Bunch of people who sneak around. Give me sense. Don't want it on easy. Normal mode. Get 25% boost. It's my score. That's always good. And. Yeah, let's go straight in. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for the journey. Explore each sector. Get to the exit before they catch you. Same as before. Tip breaches. If a room where a breach has no oxygen, try opening all the doors surrounding it to make it less hazardous. Yeah. Only problem with that is you end up just choking out your entire ship. So what do we have? Who's on what? Altair's on engines. Ezio's on weapons. Connor's on piloting. Turn on my weapons. And charge the engines. Now, let's go right here. And you arrive in a system and immediately discover a pirate ship nearby. Strange to you, scans indicate there are no life forms aboard. You salvage anything useful, but no, find no clue as to the whereabouts of the former crew. Ooh, spooky. It's a ghost ship. Yeah, okay. And. Yeah, let's jump into a fight. What's the point in playing if you don't fight some people? Scan to our remote settlement being blockaded by a pirate ship. The ship hastily messages you, stay out of here so you'll be next. Concentrate fire on whoever. No, defend the outpost, come on. And cloak. Can't see me. Oh, apparently that works. Do that, and... That's got to do something. They look like they don't want to fight. They're trying to escape. They're running away already. And you just got it. Yeah. What are you doing next to Come on. Alright, we give up. We're terrible at this pirate thing anyway. Yeah, you sure are. Free fuel missiles, 10 scrap. Piracy cannot be forgiven, so here we go. 
just cut the ship up. What are you doing? Can you pick through the remains and contact the settlement? 17 scrap, free fuel, and a missile. With the pirates gone, you signal station. We appreciate what you've done, but there's, there'll be another ship looking to profit from my isolation soon enough. So we can't help you more. Give me a missile drink for 8 scrap. I just saved their life, and that's all they give me. People in this game are cheap skates. Where can I go? Uh, I'll fly around space for a bit. Why not? Take in some sights. By the time you notice the rebel ship behind the beacon, it's too late to avoid a fight. And cloak. Oh look, there's the engine. I always thought that the engine looked quite small, but it goes all the way under there, apparently. See that there. And... Oh, I used to be able to get these in no time. There we go. Yeah, four ropes. No, what did I hit? Oh. At least they don't, like, aim for anything useful. Um, let's go there. There again. You are considerably more well armed than I would have thought. Except they're off Oh, free fuel, a drone fight, no weapon. Healing burst. And I could probably sell that for more than anything they'll give me. No, fire, fire. Ah. Ah, open all the doors. Let's go, stand in there and stop the fire spreading. That empties quick. I know I did literally just open doors into space, but... And... Yeah, they can breathe, that's good enough. Just leave them open. Oh no, they're catching up. And just go here, taunt them, sit right on the border. You spot a small rebel ship nearby. It seems to be refitted for transport rather than combat. It does not seem to want to engage you and your ship. Surrender your goods. Really, because it looks the exact same as the rest of the ships. I'm just saying. I know you said it was being refitted, but it looks the exact same. And fire the laser. And there we go. Well, I'll just get beaten up. Go there, shut the door so the fire doesn't spread. And go. Then... Ooh, where's it go? Oh, if I do that, they can't leave. Go. No! No, I'll tell you, don't die! You can't die, I've seen how the end, end of the game happens. The ship was transporting weaponry, you'll find the piece still intact despite the battle. Ew, ship. Heavy, swap you over. Yeah, don't worry, it's over, just sit there by yourself. Oh no, it's fixing it now. And, are you done yet? There we go. Come on you two, fix up. You killed the Pope and it's taking you this long to fix an engine? Come on. Do you actually... Yeah, you do. Just spoil anyone, spoiled it for anyone who hasn't played Assassin's Creed 2. He kills the Pope. There we go, there we go. Yay! Another laser. Now... Which way? Uh, let's go this one. A nearby planet shows signs of habitation and great beauty. This rudimentary automated planetary defense system is looping its message into space. Warning! Quarantine level 5. Yeah. The planet's under quarantine. How do you put an entire planet under quarantine? I mean, just logistically, that doesn't make sense. 
just doesn't seem possible. At first it appears you arrived in an empty system, but a ship appears, to, appears from behind the planet and held you. Haha, ha, I am a dread pirate Tuco, prepared to die. Okay. I'm just gonna disappear. Sure, sure, so honor by allowing us to leave our lives. Two missiles, a drone part, and ten scrap. Uh, no. Can't let Dread Pirate Tuco go away. There we go. Ship explodes, leave behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. Missile drone part scrap. Who cares? Oh look, there's another place here. I thought they would have caught up. You detect a rebel automated ship nearby. It does not engage and it seems to be patrolling around a long range sensor station. Detect the automated ship to get to the sensor station. Of course. Why wouldn't I? You attack that, you attack that. And then you do that. Wow, I just sit here and do nothing. None of these people even have to move. Ah, I could have done a challenge if I le left my cloak a bit longer. Oh well. You access the recent scans of the Ongardi station. Your map has been updated with details of the surrounding area. Nice, what's this? Ion storm? Distress call down here. And there, and there. I'll go to the store. I'll never make it back. I don't really want to be fighting these in the first sector. Oh, yeah. Cloak. Why does the cloak not just refresh afterwards? Upon completing your jump, you receive a message from a nearby ship. Greetings and welcome to our beacon. For a small fee, we'll let you continue on our way. Um, reject. No chance. Honestly, can I actually take it out? I've got to try and figure this out now. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. I need to be able to hit four rooms with this. Oh, I think I can do it. As long as everything hits, I might be able to take them out in one cloak. No, I can't. And uh, I'm gonna have to cloak it. Take the weapons. Oh no, that missed anyway, so that doesn't work. Heavy laser back on. Let's go, fix the oxygen. Um, come on. Mini beam, cross there again. No laser on shields. There we go. Ship explodes. They all seem to explode and leave behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. Two fuel, a drone part, 11 scrap. As far as none this fuel like blows up. Just saying it seems like that's what would happen. Uh, here we go. Just lock out tire in there. Open all doors. Oh, both of you fix that. And there we go, and both of you fix this. There you go. Teamwork. Assassin teamwork. Let's see, I can't remember what you've done. Weapons, that's it. 
I'll tell you. Come on, take, take that health and get back to the engines. And store. What can I buy? It's only one other ship and it's showing heavy damage. We receive a message on the console. Greetings, traveller. We're crippled by a band of pirates and now forced to sell our remaining valuable equipment to acquire necessary supplies to get home. Cool. Whatever you say. All laser. Ion blast. Teleport 75. Oh no, it's not a candle. Sell that. There we go. Now, I can, I can buy drone control. I uh, kind of want shields. kind of need shields. Just fix that. And. go. Yeah. Let's go to the exit first. Now yeah, we have that long range beacon. When the FTL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. Our ship refueling station is stationed at this beacon. We can purchase fuel here. It's a very place, very bad place to set up shop. I mean, there's literally a shop there, or well, there was. Now, uh, oh, which way to go? I always got nebulas, and they're never fun to go through. Now, Welcome to the new sector. Get to the exit beacon and jump to the next exit before the pursuing rebels catch you. Oh yeah, they've got nebula, so I'll land in a nebula. And if I go through here, to let me go through more, it slows down all the rebels. Heavily damaged Federation ship is hiding in this nebula at the beacon. Before you have time to make contact with them, they fade into a nebula. Pump extra power into your sensors. You follow the faint signatures and find them floating not too far away into the nebula. Feel to be found by friendly, so they come aboard and abandon the wrecked ship. We drive swamps! Yeah! There's nowhere for you to be, but yeah! It's always good. And if I get one more. This. Oh, black market weapon trader spin to a tower the danger nebula before pushing his wares. Purchase an unknown weapon? No, I need my scrap. Stop trying to make me spend it. If I get another one now, I can get a teleport and just take them, take over the ships. Oh, is that? Oh, no. Where? Oh, we're there. Where are they now? E easy. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah, I just haven't got enough. I'm gonna try it anyway. Oh, come on, I cloaked. It's unfair. Oh well. Swamps. Get back in there. There we go, there's his weapon sound. Yeah, help fix the weapon. Shields. There we go. Take everything we have and let's both forget this happened. Free fuel, drone parts, scrap. No, you almost killed swamps. He may have only just joined me, but I like him. I like all the Magnus people, they're just better. Unless you need time fixed, then they take forever. Ship explodes and you find a substantial collection of useful scrap material, like every other ship. A fuel, two missiles, some scrap. Yeah, you better help. There we go. Let's go back there. Swamps needs to heal up a bit more. Now I'll get back on weapons. You get back into this big empty room. And... There or there? 
Let's go to that empty place where I won't be attacked. There appears to be a number of small stations nearby. Before you have time to scan them, warnings go off. A rebel teleport was used in one of the stations we've been boarded. Brilliant. Oh well, one guy. That works. Come on, I should win this, I've got swamps. Should probably close these, so. Ah, ah, come on. Don't die, don't die. Whew. Who's cutting it? Uh, no, both of you, you go there. You, no, you go there. Kill. And you fix the oxygen before everyone dies. Open that and it should spread it out a bit. Swamps. Let's see. Uh, Connor. That. Ooh. Just in time. Out, out of here. Go heal up. Connor. Back to the pilot in chair. Clues. Oh, yeah, I just realised that. If you teleport people into the pilots, they can't evade anymore. Eww, that's useful. Should work anyway. I'm just guessing. Oh. I'm going to need to try that. Ship refueling station is stationed this beacon. You can purchase fuel here. Okay, I'll buy one. Why do they always sell next to stores that sell at the same price? That's just terrible business. Transmission from the nearby planet indicates an outpost below which offers supplies to travellers. Crew teleporter. Repair arm. Repairs your hull every time you collect scrap, but reduces scrap collected by 15%. No, I need more scrap. Um, 12, 10, 27. Wow, I just realised how low all my oxygen is. All my rooms are pink. Come on. Can you not work in oxygen? Speed it up a bit. No, you just sit there. Why can't you? I'm surprised they've got all these uh, workstations for engines and weapons and shields once you get it. You can't do it like cloaking or oxygen. Yeah. Now let's go get in a fight because we can. When you set a rebel scout on an attack approach to a small refueling outpost, the weapons are charged, but they're not firing yet. Aha! Intervene. Gotta save the outposts. Always. I don't know who you are, but no one defies the rebel fleet. Oh. This isn't going to be fun. Nothing's just going to cut through me because I've got no shields. Let's go stay in there. Swamps, go fix it. Because you're not doing anything. Yeah, ha ha. Ship breaks apart and you quickly salvage what you can. Outpost house you. Pompous bastards expected free service just because they defeated the Federation. Take this for the help. Four fuel, 25 scrap. Nice. I'm 30 away. 30 more and I can actually get some shields. Ooh, come on swamps. Fix up. Fix up, look sharp. Don't know why that suddenly came into my head, but it did. Um, now you sit there. 
store distress. Um, that air and an air. I might be able to go distress in an air and then get to store. And I might have enough. The distress signal is coming from a small space station or the uninhabited planets. Their satellite defense system has gone haywire and, they can't re and their repair crew can't approach without being fired on. They're looking for help to fix or disable it. Use your cloaking to disable the system. Okay. You use your ship cloaking to prevent the defense system from getting a lock. Once closer, you are able to safely disable the system. They thank you for your help and offer a reward. Missile drain part. Scrap. There we go. Need 10. Ooh, this is going to be close. And your jump leads to. Oh, it was pointless. And I can actually get there. I just don't have enough to buy it. It's no fair. It's just been mean to me now, this game. And. Upon completing your jump, you receive a message from a nearby ship. Greetings and welcome to our beacon. For a small fee, we'll let you continue on your way. Reject. You'd think the message would get around to stop trying to blackmail me. And what we got? That goes there. That goes there. And then that goes there. You get a frantic message. Take everything we have, just don't kill us. Fuel, missiles, scrap. Yeah, it'll be nice. It has to be nice to someone in this game. I've killed everyone else. <laughs> Buy one sleeve and free them to join my crew. Attack the sleeve of scum. 47 scrap. Is it just me or does that seem rather cheap? Um, no, just attack them and you can get them for free. Oh no, my cloak's not charged. That's quite bad. Come on, go. Oh, oh no, they're gone anyway. And there. Yeah, now you can't see me. There. Then there. Shift appears to be powering up a safety hole which is trying to escape. Continue. We surrender, I'll take one of our slaves as tribute. If you destroy us, they'll all die anyway. Come on, man. Here we got Declan. Uh, you see an oxygen because they keep shooting at oxygen. And Swamps is very slow at repairing it. And exit. You arrive at the long range beacon when the FTL drive is charged, you can jump and exit so. An advanced rebel army chip remains stationed near a small rebel space station. Sensors indicate it's a storage vessel for military goods. Attempt to cloak and access the cache. Oh, they've got... No, attack. Because they've got no shields, which means I should be able to take them out with my weapons. So wait for everything to be charged. I'll screw you. No! Ah, oh, you're just being mean. I need that. Let's wait for my laser charge up now. Come on, and that'll have to do. Dual laser there. Actually, no, I do that first. Then do that, and then do that. No, my cloak ran out. I thought I'd have it then. The station was either abandoned or shook planes. It seems to have lain unused for quite some time. Ah, oh, 
I thought I could actually get the challenge then. Come on, there we go. Might just move both of these at the same time to repair. And go check this one. And then go back. You jump into an unremarkable system. No life signs detected within scanner mode. Oh, that was a good journey. Oh, could I have gone there? Could have gone there. I've got, got both of the places. Over. Rebel controlled sector. Zoltan controlled sector. And let's keep things interesting. Go to the rebels. Sector was busting with activity just a few years ago. Now more than half of the jump beacons have been destroyed. Many settlements have been abandoned and the rebels patrol constantly. What's that? Beacon coordinates appear to be very close to a nearby sun. Well that doesn't sound safe. Oh, I could actually upgrade my ship. Got a bit spare. Small merchant ship messages you. Underground Federation comm channels are all talking about your secret mission. Let us install a weapon to help. Good luck. It's not very secret if you're all talking about it. What do I get? Hole laser. That has two shots that deal one damage to rooms with a system or subsystem and double damage to rooms without either. Oh, yeah, so if I get that much. 14 seconds to charge, 10 seconds. I could replace my dual lasers with that, but they take long to charge, do that, and... Closings upgrade, oh, I can't upgrade my power yet. Come on. You arrive at a populated sector, one merchant seems to be mass broadcasting a press from mercenary ship to aid him, shall we respond? Why, yes, let's. Great, I was worried no one would respond. My usual carrier is days late. I need you to deliver this cargo of drone parts to a small station a few jumps from here. I'll pay you a bit of scrap now, but they will surely tip you generously. Okay. Five drone parts. Uh, oh, is in the next sector. Well, this was difficult. You arrive at a location given to you by the merchant, you are supposed to deliver drone parts to a station here. You find a small research station and discover that it's putting out a distress signal. Strangely, there is no response to your house. Dock with the station and investigate. You dock with the station, you see a frantic person banging on the airlock door. Once inside your ship, he drops to the floor saying, My friends, they've gone insane! They're coming! You hand him a blaster and turn to see a number of people charging towards the ship. Ah, yes. I have double mantis. Oh, Declan, go there. Double mantis, go there. Double mantis mean I can start, like, teleporting to people. And I'll probably win. And. Who's that? They're dead. They're dead. And there it is. Now all of you go heal. Well that worked well. What do we have now? Declan. Go sit in weapons. And you can fix up that when it gets damaged. And you two can sit in this room. That should help. Uh, store there. Let's just store first. Need to try and buy buy some shields. You receive generic advertisements from a nearby public shipyard. It's good to see that don't change in the future. Or whenever this is set, I don't know. Shields. Iron Blast 2. Takes 3 power and charge time 4 seconds. Takes three times as much power to shoot twice as fast. Something about that doesn't make sense. Hmm. That's very good for keeping our shields though. Because you just permanently attack their shields and they're always ironed. 
What's, I, I've not got, yeah, I've got a whole laser I can sell. What's this worth? 32? So that gets me to 45. And then burst laser. Two power. Two shots. One damage. And doesn't this do the same thing? Yeah, and takes a second less to charge. And less power. Hmm. That doesn't seem to make sense. And they, they both look like the same thing. Okay. Whatever you say. Hold laser. I might keep that. Yeah, I'll keep that and swap it with dual lasers when I've got enough power. But for now, let's go to over here. I've just realised I've got shields and haven't turned them on. This must be one of them rebels unmanned scout ships. Look like there's no way around the fight. Okay, take two off there. Oh, take one off the med bay. And if I put one on the ship. Um, oh, hold up. Take it off there. Complicated power system. Cloak. Now everything should be charged by the time my cloak runs out. And. Hold up. Declan, go there. You two go there. Fire everything on that. And that there. And that there. There we go. That worked well. Now I'll take two off there and put them on there. And that there. Then that there. All done. Whatever fires first. Ship explodes. Leave behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. 33 scrap, that's useful. Now ship power. Need more power. And... Yeah, we should go fire all these. Small shuttle appears on the local radar. It turns out it's a rebel or made scout. And uh, it's got no shield, so I want to try and use these and take it out. Now that there, that there, and then mini beam. Cross there. Don't know if this adds up to enough. No, one short. Damn it. Oh well. Ion. Ion guns just sitting there. Ship explodes. 25 scrap. Well, you know, just enough for another power. Oh yeah, I wanted to get teleported, didn't I? Oh well, I'm just spending it all on power. How much is another weapons? 35. Hmm. I don't know. By the time you notice the rebel ship behind the beacon, it's too late to avoid a fight. Well, of course it is. I couldn't have just cloaked and got away, could I? That seems far too logical. that there and that there. Well that's off it down. Take everything we have and let us both forget this happened. For free all yes because I'm running out of fuel. Yet you still attack me. How rude. No, they won't get there to fix it in time. 
Declan, back on shield. I'll say, yeah, you need to heal. It would help if the med base turned on. There we go. And distress. 